Hello. Um, internships. Should you do them if they pay less than minimum wage? Um, this is something that happened to me um, post leaving university. That um, I had, I spent a year working in retail, and I thought, okay, it's part, it's about time I send my CV out and get in touch with um, companies that were local to me at the t at the time, and um, I didn't get. The, a role at this particular company and I said at the end of the interview um, do you offer any internships or any work experience opportunities and um, I very rarely do that because usually when I have a no I usually think okay it's a no and um, thank you very much and goodbye um, but I had reached a point where I felt that I needed to find a company within the city that I was in at the time because I I just felt like it was time to do something new and to learn something new and um, I thought it's willing I'm willing to take the risk to see who I meet and the opportunities that I might gain from uh, this, this particular company and um, I was quite disappointed because I thought that they may not have liked, they may not have felt that like I was right for the particular role, but I thought they quite liked me and I was on, um, on a wage that was just ridiculous and I don't even know if I can even say it, like I was offered I think something like £3.40 which was less than working in a shop and I thought how can I have done three years worth of work and the only work I get offered is like w less than what I would have earned if I hadn't had gone and I felt like this is sort of a cruel joke that was done by the who owned the, the person who owned the company and I thought well that's such a shame because it um I, I'm very much an open person in terms of I'm willing to try a lot of different things and to meet people and see what things I can um what opportunities and and and, and, and things and, uh, that I can gain or things I can learn uh from because I feel like you can learn anything from any situation and um, it's not necessarily what you do it's more who you know so you might meet someone through that role and think oh right that's great like I'll try that instead but it I, I, I don't even know if it was even a role like I did an internship but it ended up like sort of being like for their social media for their website um which is a you know a full-on for some people it's a full-on role it's a full-on job but I was sort of tailoring it to my taste and I managed to write an article for them and yeah I just felt like should you do it hmm so if you find yourself in a situation where you're being offered something that you know that you're overqualified for, but you're willing to take it, I think I that I've written some points, and I feel like I should share. I will share them with you. I think the first thing you should do is: is this gonna ask yourself? Is this gonna benefit me? You know, on top of what I've studied, or on top of what I've done in my life. Uh, you, you know in my career or in your career in your work will this benefit me if I did this D will I meet someone through this that will make it worth not being paid as well or not doing not doing the thing that I want to do will I be meeting someone or collaborating with someone if you're creative um, does this company that I want to work for benefit me in any way? Is there anything that I have that can benefit this company? Do I have any skills? 
app um, this company can use? You know, uh, am I trained in um, Adobe InDesign or Photoshop? Do I have moving image skills? Um, can I film? Can I direct? Can I take photos? Do I, can I write articles? Can I interview people? Can I um, take photos for social media? Can I take photos for um, the people that work there? You know, it's coming up with ideas all the time that make you a salesperson in a way. You know, that people just aren't telling you what to do all the time, that you're having this exchange. It's finding what you are good at and then selling it in a way. And is this a good reference for me? Is this, does this company that I'm working for share similar values? Does it feel like a place you'd like to be at? Does it feel right for you? Does it feel good? I think these are all important questions to ask yourself when you, if you find that you've been offered an opportunity and you're not sure. I think these are uh, several points that you should ask yourself before considering working for somewhere that might not be offering you very much money or somewhere that you're not so sure is in your field or that you can do. So thank you very much for watching today.